a second sheriff's deputy died early Saturday from injuries suffered when an inmate who was being transported in Kansas City overpowered two officers and possibly used one of their guns to shoot them. During a news conference Friday at the University of Kansas Hospital. Rohner had been with the department for seven years and King for 13 years. Bailiff said the inmate was being taken across the street from the jail to the services building for a court hearing. The inmate was taken in a van to a gated area behind the building, and when he got out of the van, he somehow overpowered and shot the deputies, Bailiff said. Share this article Share Bailiff said investigators do not believe the public is in any danger. Video from the scene showed the courthouse surrounded by yellow police tape, several police vehicles parked in the street and numerous uniformed law enforcement officers walking the grounds. Wyandotte County Sheriff's spokeswoman Major Kelly Bailiff said the suspect was wounded in the shooting that took place outside the Wyandotte County Courthouse shortly after 11 a.m. Friday morning. The suspect is undergoing surgery. No other details were released about the suspect, including his condition. Share this article Share authorities are not looking for any other suspects in connection to the incident. Bailiff said the investigation is now being handled by the police department in Kansas City. Police officer Zach Blair said authorities are reviewing surveillance video. Details of what led to the shooting have not been released. The Fraternal Order of Police in Kansas City, Kansas, said in a statement, We are praying for our friends at the Wyandotte County Sheriff's Officer, their families, friends and our entire Blue family. We are here for you all. Governor Jeff Collier was briefed on the incident as he arrived to a congressional forum hosted by the Kansas City Chamber of Commerce. He held a moment of silence for the deputies after he finished his speech at the event. Our thoughts and prayers go out to our brothers and sisters in Wyandotte County. We are standing with you, the Johnson County Sheriff's Office tweeted. Our hearts break for our brothers and sisters at Wyandotte County Sheriff's Office as well, as for the loved ones of the deputies shot today, one of whom has died. Our thoughts are with you in the difficult days ahead, the Kansas Highway Patrol wrote on Facebook. Kansas City, Kansas has dealt with other officer shootings in the recent years. TWO Kansas City officers were shot and killed within less than three months in 2016. Captain Robert Melton was slain in July while searching for a suspect in a drive-by shooting. Melton was part of the police honor guard for debt. Brad Lancaster, who was fatally shot earlier in 2016 near the Kansas Speedway. In 2015, Wyandotte County Deputy Scott Wood was shot seven times but survived 